Customer churn rate is the measure of how many customers a company loses in each period. It is an important metric for subscription-based businesses. If the growth rate is higher than the churn rate, then the customer base is growing. For example, calculate the churn rate for a company with recurring monthly revenue. Use this formula to calculate the subscribers lost. Add the number of new subscribers to the subscribers at the beginning of the month and subtract subscribers at the end of the month. To calculate the churn rate, divide subscribers lost by the subscribers at beginning of month. The higher churn rate means the company is losing a lot of subscribers than it's adding. If a business has monthly recurring revenue, it means that customers sign up and pay for one month at a time. For those companies, it makes sense to calculate the churn rate on a monthly basis. If a company has an annual subscription, then it needs to calculate the annual churn rate. To calculate a churn rate for a longer period than the recurring revenue model, such as calculating an annual churn for a business with monthly subscribers, the formula changes. The number of lost subscribers is divided by the average of beginning and ending subscribers. Because the period of the churn rate is different than the period of the recurring revenue, some of those new subscribers may have cancelled their subscriptions within the year in a later month than they first subscribed. Customer Lifetime Value CLV is a calculation that estimates the gross margin contributed by one customer over that customer's life. It is calculated using the churn rate. First calculate the gross margin. Gross margin is monthly revenue minus cost of goods sold. Calculate the average customer margin by dividing the gross margin by the average number of customers for the month. Because the gross margin was earned over the month, you must divide by the average number of customers instead of either the beginning or ending customer count. Calculate the CLV by dividing the average customer margin by the churn rate. In this example, each customer will contribute an estimated $961.96 over their lifetime. To download practice Excel file, please click on the link in the description. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.